What's up, everybody? Welcome back to another episode of the Binding of Isaac Repentance. We are still playing Judas at this point. Yep, last episode, we unlocked the Lost. <laughs> we had a huge damage down, right? Uh, because we got converted into the Lost right away. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Man, these things are just out to get me on this, this run. Yeah, so we got converted into the Lost on Depths 2. Finally unlocking that character, which is fantastic. And that gave us, like, a big damage down, and I guess I just wasn't prepared to play the loss at all. Uh, so yeah, we ended up dying, which wasn't really unexpected. Health up. Wow, okay. That is really good to see on Judas. Yep, so we are just continuing on with our Judas playthrough, since that was an unsuccessful run. We're hoping this one's gonna be a successful run. And we'll actually be able to get to the hush. And if we can't do the hush, then we still have the opportunity to do the beast, right? Um, otherwise, I think we would have to do mother on like another run? Because in order to do mother, we have to go to the alternate floors. And I don't know if going to the alternate floors makes a lot of sense when you're trying to do the hush. Because I think there's just more time wasting that you have to do in that path. That's not going to be good for trying to do the hush in 30 minutes or re uh, arrive at the hush fight in 30 minutes. So, yeah. Anyway, um, we have a bunch of money here. We found our item room. There is a shop. I think we're just going to fight the boss. We're doing Ragman as our first boss today. And it's champion version of him. I don't know what this one does differently. Please don't touch me, spider. I think this one just does more damage if Ragman itself touches you because it's champion. Okay. Soul Heart, Mom's Pearls, which is more Soul Heart and Luck. Let's go. We have an arcade. I guess we can look in here. You know what? If I can get health up from Judgy, that'd be really good. If we can get ourselves a blood bag, that'd be really good. A compass. All right. Well, not really what I was looking for, but I guess we will take it. Yeah, if we get enough red health on here, we'll probably go visit that arcade again and try and use the blood machine for a blood bag, hopefully. IV bag would be something I don't actually want. All right, a holy light. If they're just gonna give me angel items in our item room, I'm down with that. Need to get some extra luck in here so we get the holy beams happening more frequently, but yeah, I think that's good. So shop is this way. I don't have any keys to get into it. I guess that goes down towards the boss as well. All right, so since we have the poo trinket, I am gonna spend a little bit of time popping these poos, looking for health. Or just money, oh, okay. Guess we're gonna take some damage to that guy, that's fine. Come on, extra red health, come on, soul hearts. Nothing, all right. Well, I mean, getting the one half red, half soul heart poo was pretty good, I suppose. But a halfy. Not a lot that a halfy red heart's gonna do for us. That's feeling like secret room area right here. It's not. It is not. Felt like it. Okay, so we need some tier rate and some more luck. With tier rate and luck, we don't really need damage. Because the holy beams of light will will do all the work for us. Obviously, damage would just be good for all the shots that aren't the holy beams of light. Uh, Larry Jr. All right, not a bad basement two boss, and there isn't a lot of obstacles in this room. It's always annoying when you have to fight Larry, and it's got like the grid pattern of stuff. Either uh, a checkerboard of poos or a checkerboard of just rocks. Uh, yeah, you know what? I'm gonna look in here. Poor Babylon. I mean, that's two damage ups. Oh boy. All right, we're going super sketchy on this run, but we got damage. We got tier eight. 
We can see what's in... Oh, we can't see what's in the one heart battle room, can we? We'd have to have one less soul heart in order to do that. Let's just go. So we are committed for devil deal items. We got the holy beam of light, which is like an angel item, I suppose. So we kind of have both going on. Yeah, the AOE damage on the holy beam of light is really good, too, because it looks like it's a narrow beam, but it actually hits a lot of things around it. Kind of a, a bigger area. Be very, very careful here. Do I have a bomb? I have a bomb. I want that soul heart. Yo, these mushrooms, come on. Nice. Very good. Yeah, our damage is strong enough we can just... Wreck those things without having to wait for mo them to open up multiple times. Another half E. Very good. Okay, let's go this way. I'd love that black heart, but we need flight for it. One worm left. Oh, oh, there we go. Uh, sure. We have 14 cents. What do we got in here? Tarot cloth. Hmm. I don't have a bomb. No bomb. Okay. Yep. 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 Oh. Oh. Whew. Okay. Oh, well, we got a bomb now. I guess we can go blow up that guy and try and get a higher chance for a double deal. Although, with all, you know what, with only three hearts, I don't care. <laughs> I would love to be able to take things, but we don't have the health to support double deals right now. Okay, so there's a door here. Was there a door on the other side? There is. Let's go this way. Oh, that's the right way. Did we find an item room on this floor? Gosh, I can't remember. No, I don't think we did. Maybe we should go try and find our item room or just ignore it for a chance at a... Uh, can't think of the name of the room. You guys know what I'm talking about. Planetarium, that's, that's it. But we did get a double deal. We do have health up technically. Okay. Awful. Yeah, so our goal is to get to It Lives within 30 minutes and defeat it. We de out a planetarium. Check it out. Hopefully it's a good one. What was that one that we had with the orbiting tears? Is that like Saturn or Jupiter? I mean, that one's pretty good. I don't know what all the different planetariums there are. Neptunus builds a massive tears bonus over three seconds while not firing. Shooting again will release stored tears. Oh, interesting. Okay, so that's just a huge tier rate bonus. I guess that'll be really, that'd be much better if we had piercing tears. Free keys, I love it. Damage. But I guess that's also the tier rate that I was looking for. Um, boss is this way. Okay. Only got one bomb. I was thinking about bombing those mushrooms, but since we have so few. Diploplia. What floor is this? Caves 2? We're going to take that into the boss room. Maybe we get a devil deal still. 30% chance. 
Uh, let's blow up the shopkeeper in here and try and up that chance. Gertie Jr. We gotta go back and grab our book. We're not gonna take the Ploply off this floor with us, so it might just be a wasted item. Alright. Uh, mm, I'm gonna take this first. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I don't know if I want to take it again and spawn Oh, that'd get rid of all my red health. I think we I think we just go with that. Let's go back and grab our Belial and we're out of here. Yeah, I could have taken the other one and sacrificed my multi-dimensional baby for up to two more items, but yeah, I don't think I want to do that. I want to keep my health. So that was pretty good, I think. Definitely feeling strong. Uh, item room either to left or down. I'm not sure which way. Must be down. It is not here, that's for sure. <laughs> Ignore that. Oh man, I didn't even see the stone golem thing like right there. Oh, uh, yes. That'll be good for like the rest of the floor. And I guess we might be getting to the point where we might get conjoined, so that'd be cool. All we need is just one more follower. What's in here? Soul heart? Sold? Uh, I would love spider mod. Maybe we'll get another penny somewhere? This, oh, I don't have a bomb. I was going to say, is that super secret? Was there a penny anywhere else? No, I don't have a bomb. All right, well, let's just go. Yeah, let's fight the boss. I mean, maybe we'll get Pageant Boy as the item. Oh, there's a golden poo in here. Check that out. Wow. So that's the money. Unless that gives me just the counterfeit penny. Nope, that's the money. Mom item, don't really want the pills. What's in here? Dead cat, huh? I don't think so. I think we're gonna ignore that. Let's go get our spider mod item. Man, the Night Vault would also be good too. I think Spider Mod. I just like seeing enemy health bars. All right, we're out. Double was still open. It was giving us another shot at it. I mean, I think the only thing at this point I take from the double room is going to be a brimstone or like. The robes. There's an Isaac's bedroom over there. We got a arcade. I think we're gonna do a little exploring on this floor. I wasn't sure how many hands were coming down. I thought there was only going to be one there for a second. Uh, great. Uh, 
All right, well, I don't think we're gonna do anything in there. Bomb and a key is fine. Don't think we're gonna go to the cursed room. I guess I'll get the warp card. I don't know what we're gonna do with it, but we'll take it. Oh, I was thinking these guys shoot diagonally when they die, but no, I just let that shot <laughs> run right into me. What else is alive? What the heck? Oh, this guy. Okay, well, I just took that, too. Mm -hmm. So if I remember correctly, Isaac's bedroom will give you soul hearts. If you don't have any red health, it'll give you like three soul hearts. So maybe if we get another devil deal... After we fight mom's foot? Dude. Knockout drops, that could be cool. Yeah, maybe if we take a devil deal that takes two of our red health, we can go back there. Maybe? I'm not sure if we're gonna do this or not. First things first, I gotta stop taking damage. I keep taking a lot of silly damage. Easily avoidable damage. All right, what do we got here? I need a bomb, all right. Super secret, maybe? Whoa! Oh, this is Red Mama. I wasn't expecting her to stomp so quickly. Okay, we didn't get the Devil Deal. Uh, we do have a boss rush. Let's take this, take this. Let's see what's in the boss rush. Uh, tears can cause bleeding. Lord of the Flies. I think we take this and warp out. This isn't one of those crazy rooms that has eight items, no. Yeah, let's take this. We're not actually gonna do that. Uh, yeah, I think we go. Let's go back to the boss room and continue on. Hopefully we can find some more health. Super secret. Could be in a lot of these different places. So they could be here too. That's my last bomb I'm gonna use. All right, judgment. There was no extra health on this floor, it doesn't look like. HP, HP, HP. Come on, guy. Come on. Dude. Well, all right. Well, I tried. Let's go. I don't know what our time is. I guess I should have looked. We are fast enough to get to the boss rush and we didn't do the boss rush. So we should be at around 20 minutes. 16. Wow. We are actually kind of speedy, aren't we? That's good. These are eyes are not good. Kid knocked out. Okay, let's take a moment and just look for some marked rocks. Not seeing any. Even if there were marked rocks in here, I don't think we could do anything with them. Seems good. I'm not sure how everything died that quickly, but I like it. Ah! 
Super secret? Super secret? Super secret? Okay, well, I'm not wasting any more bombs. Mr. Fred. Seems good. Health, damage. Let's go. So we are on pace to do the hush right now. We can literally take our time, not rush. We can explore the rest of the floor. Try and min-max as much as possible here. Whoa. But we definitely don't need to rush at this point. And take stupid damage because of it. That's like the most important thing. We need to conserve our health as much as possible. Okay, well, not doing a good job of conserving our health yet. Hey, 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 I knew it could happen. I didn't know we'd get on that one. Man, I don't think going for that chest is worth it. But yeah, getting that placenta, that's really good from like just a random drop like that. Super secret here. Nope. Super secret here. Key beggar. We want to keep six keys for the hush. Because there's the four gold chests and then the two rooms. Three rooms. We want to keep seven keys because there's the shop too. Um, there's also this chest. Oh. Yeah. Uh, let's go fight Mom's heart. He lives. I think I just knocked it right out of... Yeah. <laughs> We're pretty strong with burst damage, that's for sure. Let's see what we got in here. Mm hmm. I don't think any of that's going to help us. But we got 10 minutes... Let's world card here. I'm pretty sure that stays open, right? I didn't just screw up. Yeah, that stays open. So we got 10 minutes to go try and find some more health. We know where the secret room is because of that world card. I guess I could bomb that out of there. Yeah, let's go over here. Judgment. Come on, buddy. Give me some red health. Hierophant is really good. I'll take two soul hearts. And red health, heck yeah, let's go. Right? So looking for more health so far has paid off. Getting extra money for the shop on the hush floor is also something that I would like. 17 cents. What else do we want to do here? I guess we just explore more floors for potential more health. Oh, 
or more rooms on the floor for potential more health. You knew what I meant. Oof. If we had free keys. That works too, I guess. Oh. I was like, what dropped? I didn't even see the item. Button. <laughs> I hate these rooms. I know, like, there's a pattern you can wait and do it more slowly, but I feel like if you just rush it before they can even do anything. Ooh, that was close. Someone's got hit. Charge key. All right, well, we're getting keys, which is good. I don't think we're going to need more than what we already have, but it's good. Surprisingly, though, not seeing any more health. Oh, man. Oh, I hate it. We hate it. Okay, that's essentially everything that we can do on this floor. We did take one hit. Not good. It is what it is. That's the risk. We took one hit, we lost one heart, but we found the Hierophant and we found a health up. So overall, I think we're fine. All right. I'm not using the Hierophant right now in case for some reason we get some way to duplicate it. I don't know how that would pos that would be possible, but there's no reason to use it right now. Okay, well, we ended up getting keys. Shot speed up. Dude, did it just drop a Hierophant? Oh my goodness, they want us to win. Booger tears, or do we take conjoined? Both of those are so good. Oh man, that's a hard decision. Duplicates one random pickup in the current room? Dude, guys. I know this is gonna be dumb. Trust me, I get it. But if we take this and we use that here, we now have two more Hierophants. And if we take this, we now have a total of four Hierophant cards. So was it dumb? This D1 is amazing. The Hierophant. The Hierophant. Check it out. We now have full health. <laughs> this went from sketchy to all right. I think I think we got this. I hope we got this. We're just gonna go and put the rest of our money in here. Now the question is, booger tears or conjoined? I think conjoined is a damage down. I think I'm gonna take the sinus infection. We'll just hope for another follower. Guys, this is really good. This is really good. I think we got this. I don't wanna be too overconfident right now, but I think we got this. We could definitely use more luck. Uh. Oh, <laughs> I didn't see that tear there. I don't know if 
if it's worth like waiting for the Neptune thing to like charge up. I guess like I can position myself and then get a uh, multi-dimensional baby in place. But I feel like if we just kind of move, let it charge up when we need to. Where can I stand that's safe? Not there. Maybe right here? Nope, I'm not safe there either. I was mostly safe, but not quite safe. Okay, am I safe here? It doesn't look like it. I just gotta dodge his bullets. Oh man, our health is so awful right now. Oh man, no, 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 no. I'm gonna watch out for these red floaty tears. Okay, we did it. Betrayal has appeared in the basement. Ooh boy. I didn't think we were gonna make that. So what did we take? We took the the Polaroid. Yeah, I guess we can go to the chest. Our health isn't looking too good. I'm glad we got all that extra health though. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, at this point we can't do the beast anymore because we've gone off womb too. So we either go to the devil or go to shield, I mean. And just like end the run at Sheol, or we go to the chest and do the, or go to the cathedral and do the chest. I feel like we should be strong enough for this if we were strong enough for the hush. Just our health isn't looking super great right now. Get rid of these things. Oh, oh, that's done. Anything behind this pillar? No. Battery. Yeah, that D1. My goodness, that... I don't remember when we unlocked that. I think that was the first time we actually got a chance to use it, though. <laughs> Just stay away from me, Haunt. What you got? Nothing. Really would have liked to have spectral tears, but you know, I think we got enough stuff already that it makes it okay. Boss is downwards. I guess we go down. Oh, that. Okay, good. That guy got confused. Otherwise, like the random shots I would have been doing would have like been really awkward to deal with. Wow. Not sure we need all that money, but wow. Oh, I just knocked him like way off the screen. I was like, what the heck? Where'd he go? Nothing behind that. Nothing behind that. All right. I think you only find things behind those in the alternate floors. Death is done. You gotta get the pony. Done. Alright, uh, Isaac? Mm, I guess we have to with what we got. So we should be strong enough that we should be able to get him into at least the second phase really quickly, and then that should be relatively okay to handle. Oh, 
Yep, there we go. The phase changed them pretty quickly. We did take a little bit of damage, which is fine. But we're strong. We're definitely strong. Let's go. I'm kind of hoping that we get a conjoined follower here. I would like to see what this looks like with conjoined. Maggie's bow is really good. Man, all of these stuff, except for the bean, I think is uh, pretty good here. We'll take the bean anyway. But I think that's the least good item. It's a lot of health. Maggie's bow, gotta love it. And then I think Maggie's bow also, also makes it so like uh, half hearts heal full hearts. Health up, please. Oh, we already got the one heart thing, so I don't think that would drop a heart. Maybe it will. I don't know. I don't think it would, though. Not bad. Okay, so the Howl at the Moon howled in here. So I'm guessing the secret room is down? Or is that super secret? Secret room. Bark at the moon, not howl at the moon. I'm not a fan of this thing. I don't I don't like having charmed enemies. It always confuses me. It's distracting. If we get a way to roll it, that'd be awesome, but yeah, I don't want it. Otherwise, free keys don't have to worry about have to worry about that. Yeah, done, monstro. All right, well, we're definitely gonna clear this floor. Oh, wait, what? Oh, it's in here. I didn't hear it before when we first entered this room. Leave a trail of creep on the floor when getting hit. I, I mean, yes, that's fine. And then I'll pop this one too. Hello, cancer. All right, now I feel real confident about continuing this. <laughs> <laughs> Would have been nice to have that for the hush fight. Oh, I took damage by running on the blood trail. I mean, I almost feel like we could do delirium too, but we already did the delirium fight, so... Uh, eyesore. Okay. There is one more. This one. And we just get a key. Alright, well. I don't know. I guess I'll see how I feel if we get delirium. There's no guarantee that we will. We had the delirium chance after the hush. Oh, he jumped right on top of me. What the heck? Yeah, I guess we have the concussive tears or whatever that we took earlier, which confused Monstro. I didn't realize he got confused when he jumped up. That's one of the reasons why I don't like those kinds of items, because it makes enemies do things that are unexpected. Um, 
Like, could lead to an unfortunate situation. So, like, eventually when we play the Lost character, I'm gonna try not to take anything like that. Or at least just be aware that I've taken something like that. More aware. Alright, so we only got like two rooms left. Not getting as many items as I would like, but, you know, sometimes the chest rooms are like that. Well, I guess we go fight Blue Baby. Get wrecked. No delirium. All right, well, that was a fun run. We we finally got the hush done. Let's win. All right, guys, that is it for this episode of The Binding of Isaac Repentance. If you liked the episode, be sure to hit that thumbs up button. Leave a comment down below. Also, re let me know what I did wrong or what I could have done better. Uh, your experiences with Judas, being that like he's got high damage but low health to start, like this is not an easy character to play, that's for sure. Uh, but anyway, that's it for today. Thanks for watching. We'll see you next time. Bye, guys.